Oh, hi there. Derek, Restoration Inc. You might be wondering why I'm sitting in this old cab on a seat covered in mouse shit drinking an ice cold Coca-Cola. Well, we're going to show you why. Okay, a month ago, a friend sent me a picture of a truck in a barn at an estate sale. So Don and I decided to go check it out. We went the day after it started. As we were walking in, the guy that purchased it was walking out, so we were a little too late. But we kind of walked around and I pouted and bought some hubcaps I didn't need. And then as we left, we left our card with the estate sale, the owner of the truck and told him if the guy changed his mind to call us. Well, a month went by and he called, so we scraped together some money and we went and bought it. And this is what we got. It's a 1936 Ford Coke delivery truck. And I believe the model is a 51. The motor turns over, all the wheels roll. And that's as far as we've got that Still had the crank handle in the cab. The motor looks complete. I don't want to set that down. There we go. Might need some spark plug wires though. Oh wait, it's gonna stay right there, I'll bet you. Yep, I bet it, well, I can't see it though. I can't see either. Okay, well anyways, it's got a tag, it's got a title. It's got patina for days. Got the radiator cap. The guy went back later, went in the garage and scrounged around, found the glove box door, which is a bonus. It's got a couple dents, a little bit of rust, but it's super cool. No floors, but they were wood, so what do you expect? And look at this, the windows even roll down. Oh, oh that's a good question. <laughs> See how it slides forward? Watch. It's back and down, up and over. Pretty sweet, huh? I think there may have been several mice living in the up above there. That's the worst part of the truck right there. And it's got a little bit, few dents in the roof, but it'll be fine. I'd like to find or make the original flatbed that was on it with the logos and all that, because this obviously was added by some farmer. Gonna need some new rubber all the way around. Wait, hold on, let's see. Somewhere it's got the Fisk boy on there, right there. The little boy holding the candle with the tire on his shoulder. Pretty cool tire. Seen better days, but look at these hubcaps. Oh, 
I think we get it running, get some new wheels, go through the brakes, and obviously it's going to need a little bit of everything, but the nice thing is it doesn't need any paint work because I think it's done. Possibly some new glass. But you can't, if this was any other truck, I would have never thought twice about it, but being how it was a Coke truck, you couldn't say no. Even look at these doors, like, sounds better than most new cars. Looks like it's a 59 AB motor. I think the battery's even in it still. Yeah, it is. She's farm fresh. And this, the window would have came out, but she is probably a little frozen. Not probably, I'm guessing. So there's our bad decision for Friday. Okay, that's it for the 1936 Ford Coke delivery truck. Make sure you ring the bell for notifications when we upload new content. And make sure you like, share, subscribe, comment, tell a friend, come back. We got a whole bunch of to do. Thank you. Have a good day. Thank you for watching. This is a good idea, said no one ever. Yeah, I'll stay in the cross braces here so I don't fall through. Look at that, that's like a 21 year old.